Okay, that's enough peace. <laughs> For right now. <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> Perhaps I'll just... <laughs> okay. I want to welcome all the, the visitors here this morning. We love that you're here. And we uh, invite you to, in the seat in front of you, there's a card. We'd like you to fill it out and let us know you've been here, but of equal importance, or maybe even more importance, is there's a section for prayer requests. And we invite you, if you have prayer requests, to fill that out. We want to be able to pray for you. We want to be able to know how God is moving in your life, and we, we want to be able to share with you when, when Jesus answers that prayer. So please uh, avail yourself of that, but also bless us with it as well. Um, the Christian Worldview Institute is uh, a part of our church. Uh, is being renewed. Uh, we, uh, you remember the different classes they've done in the past, and uh, we're, we're starting a new one on March the 17th. It's on Friday. It's a 12-week class. It's a class called Christianity and Culture that was written by our own Father Jeff Sarar. It's, uh, we invite you to come. It's $15 for the book. It's tw- like I said, it's 12 weeks. It's from 10 in the morning until noon. And also we want to open it up to... Uh, Teenagers, uh, especially those that are homeschooled, that if they come, it's, uh, it's free. Because we believe that what this class will offer is a, a way to begin this process of thinking how you're going to face society, especially if you go to colleges and the professors try to convince you there is no God. And so we invite you to come. We ask you, everybody who can come to come. It's a great class. And we you sign up in the... In the uh, where is it, sign up? It's in the parish. Okay. It's in the parish hall of sunshine, yellow seat. That's, that's a great, yeah, I like that very much. So. Also, um, prayer time with, on, on Wednesdays, where we get together and we pray. We invite the Lord to do whatever he wants to do in our lives. It's 11 o'clock on Wednesday morning. We invite you to come. It's been a powerful time. We've been doing this for over a year now. And we've seen God move in a lot of ways in our lives, but also in our ministry. And so we invite you to come and join us with that. Also, uh, starting um, this Tuesday, there's a Lenten uh, soup, supper, and devotional. So we're going to have we're going to have soup, and we're going to have a time. We're, what we're going to do for this five weeks every Tuesday night, we're going to be going through. We just finished a five week series on on the Sermon on the Mount. And we're going to each week that we come for the for the uh, Lenten devotional, we're going to review one week about how we put it in, in operation in our lives. We're going to have table discussions as to what it, what it means to follow Christ in that way. So we invite you to come. It's at 5.30 on, on Tuesday night, uh, beginning this Tuesday, March 7th. Please sign up if you're going to be coming. And please sign up if you can bring soup. Of different weeks, they have people sign up for, different, for soup, and especially uh, on St. Patrick's Day. John needs to know how many, he's going to make, a, he's bought a lot of corned beef. And he needs to know if you're going to be there to know how much to, how much to prepare. We invite you not, not to just come yourselves, but bring your family, bring your friends. Because we're going to have a great time together. But we need, need you to sign up if you're going to be there. Because he needs to know how much to fix. Also, Lenten devotionals from uh, Trinity School for Ministry are out in the narthex. They're free, they're great. It's a daily devotional for the season of Lent. Just go and get one for yourself or go get one for a friend. Uh, uh, For those who want prayer today, after the service, there will be prayer ministers up here to pray with you. We invite you to do that. Is there any birthdays and anniversaries? That's sweet. I love this. <laughs> it's y'all's anniversary. So. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Good friends along time. Okay, that's right. So what do we... Is it your birthday and your birthday. Okay. Okay. Father, I thank you so much for Marie. 
Lord, I thank you for her dedication and her service to us here at this church. And I thank you, Lord, that you have given her to us for another year. And Lord, I pray your blessing in her life. I pray, Lord, that you would continue to raise her up. That, Lord, she will be more aware of your presence. That she would hear more clearly from you. That, Lord, you would just let her relationship with you be so sweet. We pray, Lord, your blessing in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And Lord, I thank you for Ruth and for her love for us and for service to this church as well. I thank you, Lord, that you've given her to us another year. Lord, I love, I love the joy in her smile. I pray, Lord, that you would just bless her. That this year, that, that she would know you more fully, that she would feel your presence, and she would hear you more clearly. I pray you would give her strength. I pray you would give her peace. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Okay. Birthday, okay. Lord, I thank you for Carol. I pray your, your blessing in her life. I thank you that she's a part of us now. And I, I pray, Lord, that, that this year would be a banner year in her life, a year of, of coming into the calling that you have given her, that she'll be more aware of the gifting you're giving her and how it is you want to raise her up. I pray you'll give her peace and joy and you'll give her strength. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Birthday. Yeah. And Lord, I thank you for, for Susie. I pray your blessing in her life. And Lord, I pray your peace and your joy and your strength will be upon her. I pray, Lord, that she'll be more persuaded and more aware of you than ever before. And that, Lord, you would raise her up to be the woman of God you've called her to be. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Anniversary? Or, okay. <laughs> How many years? 21 years. Okay. Now you're legal. That's right. <laughs> Lord, I thank you for Tommy and Allison and for 21 years together. Lord, I pray that uh, year 22 will be the best yet. I pray, Lord God, that you would raise them up, that together they might be walking with Jesus in power like never before. That as a couple, as well as individuals, they would be more aware of you and the calling that you have upon their lives. I pray, Lord, this calling would bring great joy and peace. Lord, I pray that you would give them strength and blessing this year. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Okay. 29 years, that's great. Lord Jesus, I thank you for, for Jeff and Lynn. Lord, I thank you for the service that they've had in this church for 20 years. I thank you that you have blessed us with them being back here with us. And I pray, Lord, that you would, you would let this year be the, the best year yet. That, Lord, they would be, you would be raising them up, that you would be gifting them and preparing them for all that you have. I pray, Lord, this will be a year of joy, a year of recognition of the call, but also, Lord, the recognition of that you also call them to rest and peace. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Thank you. <laughs> it is still passing the peace, aren't yes. they?